What's going on ladies and gentlemen, it's Dan here, welcome back to UFC 3 career mode, we are moving on uh, to our next fight, we've won our first two fights, still on our way over to Mustache McGee over here, who's been doing nothing but talking smack this entire time, like, I can't believe, you know what, I'm surprised I already have like 50,000 followers on social media, anyway, let's see what we got here, uh, I got a mad, oh, I can't see the cats in the way, hold on, <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, this guy's got a gr huge grapple advantage because my grapple is trash. Um, let's see. Um, this is a, this would be a pretty decent fight, I think. His striking's good. Homeboy's grappling is really good. That's where he'd really take me over over on that one. So I have three different fights to choose from, and I'm thinking I want to go to 133 take on Godwin Voss have we haven't we fought him before no wait have we I don't even know I'll accept it either way we'll get this puppy done all right let's camp so I still have a membership here actually I could purchase a membership up what are we sitting with? But look at the weekly training cost. So I feel like we're going to lose like all our money. We won't even be able to train there. So we can buy a membership now for that. What's the best gym? Oh, this is Canadian. This must be uh, uh, St. Pierre's gym. Yeah, I thought so. Um, wrestling gym. Kickbox. That's what I need to get to. The kickboxer gym. Because that's what I currently... That's what I am. And of course, it's the most expensive one, isn't it? Oh wait, this is there's one here too. It's a it's a kickboxing gym as well. All right, hold on. I, I, that'd be funny if there was like a Bruce Lee. Either way, I think I want to keep going. Look at the jump, fifty and then a hundred. So. All right. Well, anyway, let's go ahead and do this. I gotta get some training done. So you can do no training at all if you want and save some cash. But I'm, I'm, I'm putting in that work. I'd rather get, like, do it now while the fights are a little bit on the... I don't want to say easy side, but where the competition's not that fierce and get it out of the way to prepare. You know what I mean? Alright, so I think I'm going to promote, like, I think the last fight before his or his fight. I'm not sure. So we're going to train. Unlock a key to victory. I don't even know exactly what that... Maybe I'll spend some money on that. But for now, I think I want to learn. Because I was going to... Yeah. Well, I messed it up again. I tried it and I could... I came close, but I couldn't get it. And then I accidentally hit continue. Let's get side control and don't let him out. We can't let your opponent transition here. Lock down that side control. Nice work there. Let's keep doing that. Hey, good job. That's it. You're doing well. 
Hold him down. That's right. That's how we got it. Nice. Oh, man. I took a few tries because my top control isn't that great, but we got it. Because I didn't want to not get those moves. But the thing is... Let's see. So wait, they're... Hold on, what are they? Are they submissions or submissions, right? I gotta find them. Oh, right here. Sorry. Alright, the bulldog choke. There you go. Awesome. Let's see what else we got. So what is that one? Because that's on the side, right? L2 and... But it's a level 2 now, so that should really help out. And we got... Oh, we have a rear naked choke. I think I've tried that before. But we unlocked this one as well, the rolling knee bar. I needed some submissions. The more, the better. And it's a level 2, so it'll be better. Now, there's one more thing, isn't there? Yes. New sweep. Yeah, because I never had this before. It was empty, so... Just making sure we have everything. I mean, I kind of like it because you earn moves, so depending on how difficult it is... I definitely want to get kicks. Look at my roundhouse is good. I didn't even realize. I mean, the thing is, it's stamina cost and base damage is boosted. So it's not that great. In hindsight, it'll be a lot better too. But I sure as hell want to get some more kicks. And I don't think I have any clinch moves because I haven't been working on it. But that's why they also recommend you get... I think, I think there was only three moves anyway, so those are all of them. Oh, dude, I'm psyched. That's awesome. Glad I got it. I'm, I'm mad that I wasted that last time with CM Punk because I definitely could have. Now that I know how to block the, the transitions properly, you can keep them grounded. You just have to constantly be aware, you know? So we're going to keep... You could spar, but what is the key to victory? I don't really understand what it is. I, oh, I know what it is. It probably tell, like gives you information about his weak, like what's the best way to take that guy down. Because I want to work on my top game for sure. Because that's why it was a lot tougher for me. I took take my takedown defense. Went down. Submission offense. Just in case. I, I think I want. Because I want to get some wins by submission. If I can. We have 20 left. I can go. I can keep going with the. Oh, that's the stance. Takedown defense. Oh, yeah. It's just giving me the 20s. I can do this again. Get that top game up. Slowly but surely. I mean, I kind of like how they've done it as well. Sorry, I'm trying to steeze. Hi! Oh, excuse me. Alright. I don't know if this is the gym I want to keep going with. Keep going with that top.
I'm already better. Alright guys, boss versus Quinn up next. There we go. Uh, three times on my the all right, so here he is, a very accomplished striker, finally making the walk to the Octagon tonight. Gotta think he'll be interested, of course, in keeping this fight standing in his wheelhouse. And he's got the takedown defense to keep this fight where he wants it, no doubt. He'll be looking to put on a striking clinic here tonight. This guy is an excellent striker. What he wants to do is utilize his footwork, his takedown defense, and land hard strikes to get... Keep working that, man. So as this guy makes the walk here tonight, let's talk about the kicking technique. It is just outstanding. He doesn't telegraph anything. He gets his foot to the target blindingly fast. Shades of Edson. All right. Well, anyway, I should look at the stats here. We're same, pretty much the same. I just have a reach advantage. With similar height and some differences in reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the blue corner, a kickboxer holding professional record of five wins, no losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting out of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada, the gentleman. Yes, sir, the gentleman. Take your bows. <laughs> fighting at the red corner, a kickboxer holding professional record of 15 wins, four he stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 184 pounds. Fighting at a line in Hull of the Netherlands, the cooler. The cooler. That's r the cooler. Okay, then. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Bergliotta. All right, Dan, Dan Bergliotta, call it down the middle. Let's do it. You ready? Touch gloves and come out fight. Let's go. Good to have you with us, and right on time, I might add, as we get underway here at the O2 Arena. Oh! All right, ready to go for round one. As many of you that know, this young man won his go. last fight by knockout. No TKO, flush knockout for him the last time out, and now he is getting a shot against a truly elite fighter in this division. The oh, is, I got hit in the nuts. When the challenges get stiffer, will his game Oh, I hate wasting stamina level? like that. Throughout his career, when the challenges have gotten tougher, he has raised his game. That is exactly the goal in front of him tonight. Oh, he, he left himself nice open. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Working on did a I block it? Right I did here. block it. Excellent movement on the ground here. Backside. Constantly moving, constantly staying Ball. busy. Oh, actually, I want to backside. I don't know why I did that. He's going for a leg sweep? Yeah, he did. He's doing a great job. Half guard, and then I gotta go full, and, and I gotta get up. Here on the ground. Full guard, full guard, and then I'm gonna stand up. Now he's in guard. There we go. Oh, and he escapes. Yeah, that's up stamina to back. His feet. Very nice. He just whips that punch in. And both fighters exchange. Oh, Haking stuck. Oh. Block it. Block it. Jab. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Oh, that's lame. Come on, hit him! For God's sakes, man, block! Well, he gets cracked I'm getting wrecked out here. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You gotta get that hit I've switched sides. Misses the takedown. Straight punch is good. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. He just tagged him with that uppercut. Oh my god, block, yeah, block, block. block. Things, Powerful Powerful uppercut. Uppercut. We're going at it now. He is backing it up, backing it up. Oh man, I took that here. shot. Switch sides, for God's sake. Go go ortho. Nice head kick. Tags and now he lands a combination. Oh! No, 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 he got me. Damn it, that was a good kick. That saved his ass. Get up, get up, get up. Damn it. He's a lucky pot. He's the lucky one there. Oh, damn, that would have been money. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Tagged him. Blocks that strike. He lands an excellent combination. Splits the guard and connects with the Take him down. Got him, single leg. Posture up. Start wailing. Right hand on point. Working out of the half guard here. Oh, he got it. Posture up. Posture up. 
20 seconds to go. Side control. Excellent movement on the ground here. I want to get a move from north. Position. I want to get like a submission from north south. I think it's like a, a guillotine. A All right, I'd say I took that round for sure. You have submissions. Take the fight to the ground. Look, yeah. My submission's not good enough though. I don't think it is good enough to win. I mean, you could keep going, but it's a waste. Uh, it wastes Here's a lot a of stamina. Kick that results in a knockdown. See, that put him on his. See, sometimes what's annoying is I go into for the strike to like try and finish him, Let's but he wasn't the, on the fl flush of his back. That's what's making me wonder if that's what's happening. Okay, round two, ready? Ready? Here we are, early round two. All right, man. Oh, I should have taken advantage of that. Big left hand there inside. Hard straight punch. The big right hand. I'm in the corner. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. And he connects with the punch there. Oh, oh I thought I blocked it. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Couldn't agree with you more. I hate wasting punches like that. Oh, that was a good counter. And both guys really throwing with authority. Did I get him? I blocked it. There's a block. Get on his backside. On the right side of his body. He's blocking it. Go to the back mount. Oh, he blocked it. Oh, I can't get on back mount. That that's like an. I'll try it again. Excellent move. I'm gonna get up. Transitions here on the ground, staying busy in the half guard. Just get up. I'm too tired. I'm trying to get up. Just over three minutes to go in round two. There we go. Let my stamina get. But see, that's what I don't oh, want to so do. An interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. I'm a striker, two. but we both are. Here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh God! That Block. Will work right through the guard. Oh, he's got hand skills for days. Beautiful. Oh, oh Jesus! Get him! Go! 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 He's blocking it. Go! Punch! Punch! I'm tired. He's melting. That's it. Come on! I'm so tired. There's not much I can do about this. Oh my God! Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. He's landing some serious ground and pound strikes here. I'm too tired. My stamina's not good enough. I'm trying to get up. Big punch from the bottom. I gotta get up. I gotta let my stamina. There you go. He's posturing up here. Big shot from the bottom. Uh, this is what my friend used to do. He would like whenever we'd fight, he'd he wait till he got me on the back. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy for. And then on, he'd like get him up, and then he'd do that every time. Look at my stamina. Now to go in the fight. Big shot. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw off that. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Man, that cut is only Come on. Worse. Working him. Can we take busy. him down? He's doing Keep a it great going. Job of utilizing the ground and pound He's here. almost done. Really He's almost done. Shot. He's done. Oh, my God. The patience. Woo. My goodness. <laughs> oh, my God. Victory oh, that was beautiful. That was just so, I had no wow, stamina. I was just, just so like tired. Like, literally every punch, I had to wait for my stamina to come back. We get the oh, it was the remarkable. Huge shot to drop his opponent. Finally made it. There was too much. There. Too much happening. Here now Bruce Buffer with oh, the he, See, decision. I kept working that, that left eye of his. Referee Dan Mergliante has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 44 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by Nathan, the gentleman. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night. I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go. But at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one. And he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends after this monumental victory here under the bright lights tonight. That was awesome. That was uh, that was quite. He had way more significant strikes, but I was just wailing on him. I gotta work on stuff though, man. I know it's a work in progress. Slowly but surely getting those victories.
Win all fights by stoppage. Give me that money. I'll check this out. Look at that. This is the, the one punch that did it. Look at all the likes it's getting. That fighter didn't even see that punch coming. He only saw it go back, going back. The only difference is this guy's striking is better. So I think I might go with this guy here, Jonah Ross.
Yeah, okay. There you go. That's a modifier. So if you get up. New submissions as well. Brand new one. Let's get it. The arm triangle. So is there anything else? Because I know we have something else. Wait, what are my current combos? Oh, let's see. Oh, I can't adjust them. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, I can. Whatever. Leave it for now. Is there anything else? Let's see. Hold on. Let me see what else we got. Outside trip. Well, I definitely want it. Okay, outside trip, arm trap. So we got the two. So we need the outside trip. I don't know where that would be. Would that that'd be a takedown, wouldn't it? Maybe? Yeah. There you go. Alright, let's equip it. Everything we can get. And eventually we'll try and get all the moves from them. We don't necessarily need them, but. Alright, let's get the perks going. Improves finishing submissions when on the bottom. I'll take it. And this one is improves abil fighter ability to get to their feet. Awesome. I, re I think they had perks in the last game. If I'm not mistaken. We gotta get in that training. This is actually pretty exciting. I do like this. Alright, so that's week one. So I'm wondering if we should just... Yeah, let's train. Let's use the rest to train. I could also like... Because the thing is, this targets certain things. Like, this is all wrestling-based stuff. Get the clinch up. My grapple is trash. Oh, that's all I can use. That's okay. Boost that a little bit. Alright, so that's week one. I wonder if I should spend, like, for, to get that bonus. The, like, I should look at my objectives eventually. Let's keep working. The, get that top game up. Because I've noticed ever since improving the top game, things got better. And you can feel it. I'm going to do more into that. Here we go. Get some deadlifts. Get that strength. And then pummels, the clinch, and the grapple stamina. Okay, so you there's like a one-time fee to buy a membership for each gym. And then... I want to get this. Get, my bottom game needs improving. I think I'm going to do a second one there. Get those gains. We're getting gains right now, y'all. My top game is actually really solid. And I'm also, while I have it, do some deadlifts, improve the power. And then the pummels end with that. So yeah, because like doing that's 1.2 every time we do it. It's a big gain for the clinch. Which I haven't really done that much, but... A clinch takedown could be good. Last week, so let's get gains. Big games. Top gains is going up. Or is top game is Oh, there it goes. Minus four into blocking. So where is that? Wow, so I was at a 79. Let's get it back. Unless it doesn't go up during this stage. My stamina is actually really high. The treadmill, this thing is dope. There you go, power. That's what I've been trying to work on. And then we go here. That always goes up. Alright, our peak finish fitness is at 98% going to the fight. We lost a bit of blocking, which kind of sucks. But it dropped us to a 75. Considering we are at a 79, that's pretty good. It's time for the fight, though. Let's do it. Coming up next, we get to this UFC middleweight division fight. Mr. Ross. Yep. Like, uh... Well, Joe Rogan, this is as accomplished a kickboxer as has made the walk to the UFC octagon as we've seen in the last several years. I'm excited to see his kickboxing skills on display in this particular matchup. Really a nice arsenal of kicks. He'll attack that lead leg beautifully, not to mention the solid punching technique that he brings to the table. This man is a danger for anyone in his striking range. 
when that octagon door closes, we're expecting fireworks tonight. This guy is an excellent striker. What he wants to do is utilize his footwork, his takedown defense, and land hard strikes to get the victory. All right, I'm ready. All right, here he is, ladies and gentlemen. This is as accomplished a submission specialist as we've seen cross into the UFC in years. And other than the Damian Maya types, most guys just aren't used to facing a He's also at Canadian. This level. You got to think. I wonder he's fighting out of. To the so he's gonna try. And, yeah, he so said he's gonna try and. A submission. This he's gonna try and submit me. So it's probably a good idea that I dropped it. Fight. Oh, see, I'm now I'm 28. I got older. <laughs> With some differences in height and a similar reach. Here yeah, he's a lot taller, but he's so he's got that. But he, the thing is, I got to take him down fast. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of six wins, no losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. The gentleman. The gentleman. Take your bow. There you go. <laughs> I love that. Oh, he's Victoria. Magnifico. I disagree. Mario Yamasaki draws the assignment here. What's it go? Oh, Houston, Texas All right, pound it, bro. Huge market for the UFC we buddies. of late, and no surprise, we are back and now underway here from Toyota Center in the H Town. So you got to be better than that. All right, here he is, ready to go for round one of a possible three, and his opponent would be wise to get the guard up here early. This man has won his last three fights, all of them by flush knockout. Each knockout more impressive than the That would have been good for a kick. He can keep it going here tonight. Oh, I hate wasting it. Plans an outside leg kick of his own. Oh, he missed that kick. Plans a big right hand early. Huge kick. We both kick each other in the ass. Oh. He's blocking almost all these shots. Who is? Probably him. Nice jab. Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed it flush. So let's see if oh. he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. That's a bad. That's see, that wasn't efficient. Nice leg kick. Straight punch gets through. Back and forth we go. Every shot he throws, he's looking to KO you. Oh! This fight is dangerous. Oh, go! Oh, he's done! Oh, my God! That's all it... Oh, my... He threw an incredibly large volume of strikes. Dude, that was so dope. was the big one that landed for the knockout. That was absolute money. Oh, that big old right hook. See, that's the one that that knocked him out there. He was done. That was a knockout. Boom! Bruh. Check out this angle here. Ugh. That was it. I'm just wailing on him. Like, look at that with these lefts. So there he is as the Back celebration flip. continues. Woo. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer Holy, has the official Holy, that was decision. amazing, dude. I loved that one. I gave him with that big Mario kick. Yosaki. It's because I... I you got to keep moving. Seconds of the very first round. I'll buy the I'll buy the Timmy's. So I will. The, man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight, as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money. Because where is the Toyota the Center the exactly? I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends. After in Texas, okay. Victory here under the bright lights so I was like, we can if it's in, if we're in Canada, but I guess in in Canada it'd be spelled like 
C E N T R E. Oh man, he he barely had any strikes landed. He kept missing. I was blocking. That was just what I did. It was I kept going body head to keep him guessing, and then he leaves himself open. That's the that's the thing. That was a good fight. All right, one more fight remain in the contract. Now here's where I'm gonna check. Hundred grand in my bank account. Check this out. Look at that wailing. Oh my god. Matt, Matt and McClellan, another win for me. That's savage. So these are the guys who are like filming that, or are they just retweeting it? Or what would you call it? re ea it. Microtransaction. That's what their social media is called. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media. Those will be down below in the description and play at the end card of this video. Facebook.com slash DanQ8000. Plenty of live streams and other content on there. Twitter, DanQ8000. Instagram, danq 8 k And Snapchat, DanQ8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my shop in the description as well. And if you'd like to save 10% off a DX Racer chair, there's my link in the description for that. Thank you guys so much again. Take it easy. Have a fantastic day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. So pretty, so pretty. Put you in the gear, team brave, bitch. See me better tap out before you see a blackout. Back out of the cage, you may fight another day. Till then, do the dance. One, two, get in tune with the motherfucking chain. Yeah.